it's the first night that we've really talked about executing a game plan and a, a pretty complicated game plan. We did a really nice job of staying with that through three really tight sets. And that's a pretty good UAB team, and I thought we hung in really well. About the fact that we needed to be good in serving service team. We passed really well. We took them out of their offense. Uh, the big thing is we were able to execute a pretty, a pretty good blocking scheme, put a block on their left side hitters. We did a pretty good job containing those kids and forced them to do some things that they ne didn't necessarily want to do to try to beat us. And, and uh, you know, fortunately, we were able to, to finish that out in three. It's a high water mark for us. You know, I mean, that's that may be the best match we played in the in the two seasons that I've been here, and that's the best we've looked maybe ever. We got to get we got to get a little better at, at, at continuing to execute through the course of a match. We had a couple of lapses. Um, we've got to get a little better um, offensive production out of our right side. Uh, but I, you know, I feel like that's going to come. Uh, we saw some freshmen grow up tonight, so you know they're just going to continue to grow and improve. It's going to gain a huge amount of confidence from this. You know, we started our season last year 0 and 12, and and to, you know our day today we started out a little slow this morning, but you know we knew we were going to have to play a tight match tonight, and, and you know they really gutted that out, and, and they just made up their minds they were going to do something, and they, they went and followed through with the game plan. That's a that's a big step forward for us. That's a good team from a good league, you know, and, and we went into our we went into our conference schedule last year 0-12 with no confidence. So, you know, winning early makes a huge difference. It fixes a lot of stuff.